Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello and welcome to the video for what is the Vislog text node. So we're gonna run through a quick little example here. We'll play and we'll hit logging. I'll move my character over to here. We'll hit three. We'll see an entry in our Vislog. Maybe go over here and hit three. And we'll go over here and we'll hit three again. We'll hit stop. We'll click on our character. Let's stop the recording as well. But here's our log entry. And we'll scroll through. And you notice down here, we have an entry called test log. The log entry. It says something is broken at, and it gives me a location. And if we scroll through, you'll notice it changes for the different entries that we have here. With this being where our character was. So let's look at the node itself. So here is our node. Vislog text. And it's really simple. It takes in a text and a category. That's all you need to set up. It's going to add an entry to your visual logger at the timestamp when you call this node with whatever text you've put in there and whatever category you've put in. So in this case, I have a special category called test log. So that way you can see right here, it's under the test log category. Now for the advanced options, we have the context object, which you can ignore like the other vislog nodes. And then we have the add to message log. So this one's nice if we check it. We'll compile and save, go back into here. We're going to clear this out. We're going to run through our example again, turn on logging. We'll put an entry, we'll put an entry, and we'll just add a couple different entries as we're running along. We'll stop that, we'll stop that. If we go through here, you'll notice we have our normal log text inside of our visual logger, but our outlog itself also has the same thing. We have our category and then the text that we put in there inside of our output log. And that's it. That is what the vislog text node is. It's really simple. It logs text either to the message log like any of the other ones or just straight to the visual logger itself. Just simply whatever text you want with the category you want. 